Okay, after you installed the hard drive, your file explorer is just not going to find it. It's never going to find it because it's there's no partition on the drive. You see, there's only the C drive, which is the drive that originally came with your computer. In order to set up a partition, you need to go into your control panel. Wait. You have to go into your control panel. In the search, I would just type in partition. And we're under administrative tools, and it says create and format hard drive partitions. You click on that, and brings up this disk management. This will locate it. This disk zero is your regular C drive. Now there's this disk one that you just you just plugged in. It's going to show up black, not blue, because there's no partition. In order to create a partition, you right click on the drive and you hit new simple volume. Now there's a new solve simple volume wizard. You just run through the wizard and the drive letter you could have anything A through Z. Anything that's not taken, I'm going to hit Z. Next, I'm going to have the NTSFF and the volume label, I will have it as new drive. And I'm going to have actually, yeah, I'll have a quick format it and hit finish and it will create a partition which is new drive Z. Now it now if I go into my computer here it is new drive Z. It is totally a new drive, there's nothing on it, and now it works. And that's how you create a partition on a new drive. Thanks for watching.